Ai Hitam MP Wee Ka Siong has called on the government to bring back the goods and services tax, which he said is more efficient. We said this during his debate on Budget 2024 in Parliament today. He commented on the government's move to introduce e-invoicing to overcome revenue leakage and said that it was already a part of GST. We also noted that a corporate tax in Malaysia can be reduced if GST is revived. He said Malaysia has one of the highest corporate taxes in the region at 24%, compared to Singapore, Brunei, Thailand and Indonesia. He added this will deter foreign companies from opening a business here and instead they will run to countries with lower corporate tax rates. With this, he urged the government to move on for the sake of the country and people and said they could change the name of the tax if they didn't like it. He said everything is more clear and transparent with GST and current problems can be solved with it as well. Ketiadaan GST menyebabkan kadar cukai korporat kita antara yang paling tinggi. Syarikat asing yang hendak membuka perniagaan akan lari ke negara jiran yang kadar cukai korporatnya jauh lebih rendah. GST adalah cukai yang efisien. Kalau tak suka nama, tukarlah nama. Pakailah apa nama. Lupakan kisah lama. 